Snow White and the Evil Queen actress Brett Cooper says the movie will not be a, quote, MAGA conservative movie, but instead will focus on timeless values of the original Brothers Grimm fairy tale. Let's get into this here. In a recent video upload to YouTube, Cooper reacted to a TikTok video of YouTuber Ryan Kinnell, noting that people, quote, don't want propaganda on the other side. They just want propaganda-free entertainment. That's what Kinnell said. So in response to that, Cooper stated, and that really is the main point. We're not trying to turn Snow White into something it's not. We're not trying to turn Snow White into a MAGA conservative movie. We're just trying to represent the values that Snow White is based in, the timeless values that we all loved growing up that are sadly being forgotten in this new Disney Disney adaptation. Later in the video, Cooper reacted to another TikTok user sharing a reaction video uh, to the Snow White and the Evil Queen announcement. And she said, we don't give a crap about being woke, but more importantly, our creative team actually gives a crap about the source material. They want to tell the original story with the values and the themes that made the Brothers Grimm fairy tale so famous and important to begin with. She then listed out a number of those values. She said values like love and kindness and friendship and inner beauty versus vanity and romance for Pete's sake, because she because apparently that's missing in 2023. Uh, she also responded to comments about her hair being too short, given Disney Snow White and the Seven Dwarfs featured the character with short hair. That's the original 1937 classic. And then obviously the Rachel Zegler version has the short hair as well. Uh, so she informed her viewers in Disney's animated film, her hair was short. But for the Grimm story, every illustration that you can find has her with long hair, which is actually more accurate for the time period, which is also something uh, we are trying to stay in line with. So it looks like it's going to be a period piece as well. Uh, potentially maybe um so so what so that that's interesting so that is what brett cooper had to say about snow white and the evil queen that is arriving on uh the bent key streaming service from daily wire sometime in 2024 so let me know what you think of her comments uh in the comments below subscribe for more